All right, thanks, Jeff. Well, giving back to those who have served our country. One local barber shop marked Veterans Day with free haircuts for servicemen and women. Way 31 evening anchor Marie Waxel shares the story of one man who says Huntsville celebrates veterans unlike any other city does. This town is very, very kind of veterans. Ronnie Dent very and his wife moved to the Rocket City from New York several years ago. It started day one. Day one, we, we never asked for uh, a discount or what are you doing for veterans. They just kind of offer it here. And it's a nice open door for veterans to come here and be well and feel welcomed. He served in Vietnam and worked for the federal government during his military career. He says Alabama, especially Huntsville, gives back to veterans more than other states. I'm a disabled veteran, so I pay no tax on my home here. And that's a big plus when you're looking to save, not to save money, but to live a decent life. That's something Dwayne Perro and Ollie Taylor hope to help give with free haircuts at Taylor's original barbershop on Veterans Day each year. I think these types of uh, contributions that organizations can do, uh, whether it's on Veterans Day or throughout the year, uh, mean a lot to veterans. It's just, just a token of appreciation for their uh, you know, sacrifice and service uh, to our country. Perro says he knows firsthand how much a haircut can mean to a veteran. Yeah, I'm really appreciative, you know, of getting, you know, a, a free haircut myself because it's something I do on a regular basis and a lot of military do continue to keep their hair short. And so, you know, something like that kind of goes hand in hand with the appearance that, that a veteran would like to maintain. As for Ronnie, he says getting drafted into the Vietnam War changed his life for the better. The military straightened me out and I was very fortunate. I got chosen for leadership training school and I think that was the big difference in moving forward and then going to uh, airborne school and then Ranger Academy. It, is, it just changed my life.